Hey everyone, welcome to my Adobe Draw tips and tricks you must know. If you have any questions or tutorial suggestions, leave them down below in the comments. Subscribe if you're new, and give the video a like if you learned something new. The first tip I have here is in your settings panel in the bottom right when you open the app. Select Preferences. You'll see an option for Stroke Smoothing, and this gives you the ultimate straight lines while drawing. Go ahead and change this setting to After Drawing. If you plan on recording Adobe Draw with a screen recorder, go ahead and click the Show Touches icon. This will make the orange circle appear where you touch. If you're using a stylus and accidentally draw with your fingers, turn on the option Gestures Only to prevent that. Or you could use Eraser Only, meaning your fingers can be used as the eraser. In this first example, this brush is using stroke smoothing while drawing. In the second, this brush is using the preference I use after drawing. It's much better. To use the fill tool, your lines must be connected. Sometimes you have to zoom real close to see if they are connected or not. Once they are connected, just hold in the middle of the blank area that you'd like to fill in between the lines as so. To use the color selector and or eyedropper tool, go into your brush and press and hold on the color option. And while still holding, move it onto your canvas and then place the crosshairs over the color you want to select. To import a picture, tap the plus above your layers panel and then click image layer. Then simply browse for your image. To change the size of your image, select the layer and click transform. Use your fingers to zoom it to your desired size and location. If you plan on tracing over your image, it might be hard to draw because it's too dark or your brush color is similar to the tracing image color. To fix this, you have to turn down the opacity. Just simply click the layer and then bring the opacity down to 70 to 80 percent. You can go ahead and trace your image out. I like turning pressure dynamics off when I trace. Let's say you draw one killer eyebrow. You can duplicate it. Click the eyebrow layer and then click duplicate. You'll now have a new layer appear. Select the new layer and click transform and at the bottom click flip horizontal. Move it to the other side, position it, and there you go. I like to color a few different hairs on each side to spice it up. I'm now going to use shapes to draw some circles for the eyes. You'll see a panel at the top right with some shapes. Click it and select the circle. Move it to your desired location and draw it out how much you need to. You'll notice I'm not drawing the full circle, but just enough to get the eye. Do the same for the pupil, but fill the inside of the circle like you learned before. You can practice your duplicating once again with the eye. Let's say that your canvas size is too small. There's a fix. Tap the gear icon at the top right of your screen where the panel is and then select the first option, Format. You can then change the canvas size to your liking. J -H -C 
When merging layers, you can only merge layers down. So select the top layer and click Merge Down. This will merge the two layers side by side. Now let's say you did the tracing and you want to do some coloring. First, I'm going to fill the hair with black and make the trace layer 100% opacity again. Then after, duplicate the black line work. Make sure that you have the duplicated line work selected on the bottom, so the one underneath the top one, and then use your color selector or eyedropper tool on the trace skin color. This will give you a good color to fill. Just hold your brush in the space you want to fill and color in any areas that didn't get filled like the eyebrows. Let's do the same with the eyes and fill the duplicated eyes with color like I did with the skin. Hopefully these tips helped. If you have any questions or suggestions, leave it in the comments. Subscribe if you're new and give this video a like if it helped out. See you later.